Breaking tonight, a domestic violence 911 call turns into a dad holding his eight-month-old son hostage. And now that suspect, who's considered armed and dangerous, is on the run. Good evening to you. I'm Eric Von Aiken. Thanks for staying up late with us. So this happened along Indian Hill Road in the Pine Hills community of Orlando. News 6's Vanessa Ariza is at that scene with more on the search for the man now. And deputies say that suspect barricaded himself inside of this home for hours, but he was able to get out without law enforcement noticing. Tonight, deputies say that he is on the run and armed and dangerous. It was just before 4 o'clock this afternoon when a 911 call was made about a domestic violence incident at a home on Indian River Road. Authorities say 21 year old Kendrick Anderson and his girlfriend got into a physical fight. Inside the home with them was their eight month old son and his grandmother. Things escalated. They dialed 911. Um, victim two, which is the, the mom, grandmother of the child, comes out and is trying to stop the dispute, for, uh, the dispute that's going on. It appears that the male has a weapon and shots fired. She was not injured and then he barricaded himself inside the resident with a child. When deputies arrived, the mother and grandmother of the child were outside the house. Still inside, Anderson and his son. More than five hours later, SWAT teams went inside the house and were able to safely get the child out. We saw deputies carrying a child around that same time. About an hour later, SWAT attempted to go back in looking for Anderson, but he had since got out of the house without anyone noticing. After the baby was secure safely, they went inside and checked the resident where they discover that the black male, 21 years of age, um, was at large, is at large at this time. Anderson has a history with law enforcement. He was last seen wearing a white t-shirt and black shorts. Authorities are asking if you have any information regarding Anderson's whereabouts, you're asked to call Crime Line. In Orange County tonight, Vanessa Ariza, News 6.